I like sliding the camera around because I don't feel, I feel like I have one second to prepare myself. Okay, I'm back. And I was talking about my history of recording myself. I should probably do this in segments. Okay, I have to talk about what I just felt then. Part of what this is about. Self-exploration and... I don't know, is it self-exploitation? <laughs> Definitely putting things out there. Just then I just felt this complete... veil of embarrassment. I was going to say a, a wave of embarrassment, but... it felt like a, a soft veil just dropped in front of me. And it was saying, you're a dumbass. What are you doing? It's so embarrassing. But I have to continue because in my live journal, uh, where I'm going to be posting this but also on YouTube, I've been encouraging other people to try the same thing. And I understand. I do understand. Even though I have my own little history of liking to record, and, and I do understand that fear and uh, the... Uh, <laughs> the anxiety about fumbling, mm, prime example, what I just did. I understand that. Um, but that's what I like to do. I like, I get very frightened of certain new challenges, but once I actually jump into them, I'm, I'm usually really glad that I did. In fact, I'll have to say I'm almost always glad that I did. I, I often find that I'm, my fear is so out of proportion to what's actually going to happen. You know? Oh my gosh. As you, as I do this, maybe as you begin to do this, as I do this, I, I can't help but keep thinking about new topics and new avenues that I want to explore and to talk about. I honestly think that talking like this, uninterrupted, and in the moment unjudged, although I will be judged later, is so beneficial because you are, anybody who does this, I am, learning about myself. And I think that's always a good thing. You know, let's go back to the old bromide of you can't love somebody unless you love yourself. I mean, blah, 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 blah. But you can't present yourself honestly until you know yourself. At least that's what I'm, I've come to believe. So I don't think that it's worthless or that my time could be spent doing something better if what I am doing with my time is exploring myself and getting to know myself because then when I really know who I am, I can present myself more honestly. And that's how we connect. That's how... I'm attracted to people who present themselves honestly. So if that's what I'm attracted to, that's what I'm going to want to do myself or learn how to do. And okay, I think this was supposed to be a video about me talking about my history of recording myself. And I went off on a tangent. But that's okay too. Alright, I'll, I'll talk about the other stuff later. Because now I really should do some uh, chore. This was my reward for the day. <laughs> Gotta follow it up with some chores. <laughs> Enough.